Good evening guys. It's um, a little bit bright still, but it's bedtime. Okay, I want to show you something. Here is what we've read so far. Playhouse. Put me in a book. And down the drain. And here's what we have left of uh, Robert Munch books. So I think what we're going to do, let's put these away. And why don't we start off with I'm so embarrassed for book number four. Okay, so are you guys all nice and cozy and you're ready to read? Good. Because uh, after you read this, you have to go to bed, all right? So let me, Daddy put on his reading glasses. Looks like Daddy in the front there. I'm so embarrassed by Robert Munch. Andrew, said his mom, let's go to the mall. You need some new shoes. No, said Andrew. You will always embarrass me when we go to the mall. You always say you are not going to do embarrass me, and you always do. So no, I am not going to go to the mall. I promise not to embarrass you, said his mom. Ha, said Andrew. But he went anyways because he really needed to get some new shoes. Pretty cozy and fun there, doesn't it? Up to the mall. <laughs> Just at the door to the mall, Andrew's mother said, Oh, Andrew, you didn't comb your hair. So Andrew's mother spit on her hand and patted Andrew's hair till it was all flat. Ugh. Uh oh, what's going on here? Ah, yelled Andrew. Spit. Mummy spit on my hair at the mall. Very embarrassing. Oh, dear, said Andrew. Andrew's mom. I'm sorry about the spit. I keep forgetting how big you are. Don't worry. I'll be very careful and will not embarrass you again. Ha! Huh, said Andrew. Ew. So Andrew and his mom went walking down the mall and Andrew saw his aunt. Please, please, said Andrew. Don't say hello to, to my kissy aunt. Oh, Andrew, said his mom. I have to say hello. So Andrew's mom said hello and Andrew's aunt gave him a big hug. Scrunch! And a large wet kiss that left lipstick all over his face. Kiki, kiki, mommy's laughing. Ooh. Quack! yelled Andrew. Lipstick hugs and kisses, lipstick hugs and kisses at the mall. I think I'm gonna die. And somebody wrote in here, no. Andrew hit up the tree. Andrew's mom talked to his aunt for about three hours and then she said, Andrew. Where are you? Don't get lost. Why are you going? Why are you up the tree? I'm definitely going to get lost if I don't stop getting hugs and kisses," said Andrew. "Hugs are nice," said his mum. "Quack," said Andrew. Uh oh, they walked some more, and Andrew saw his teacher. "Please," said Andrew. "Please, please, please, do not let my mum say hi to my teacher." But his mum yelled, "Hello, Andrew's teacher!" Andrew says, you are the best teacher ever, and we are so happy that he got you for a teacher. And would you like to see some of Andrew's baby pictures? Ah, oh, yelled Andrew. Baby pictures, ah. Oh. Andrew said his mom, stand beside your teacher. I'm going to take a picture. <gasps> oh. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Andrew ran away. His mom found him and said, Andrew, why are you hiding behind a trash can? Baby picture, said Andrew. You show baby picture to my teacher? Very embarrassing. You promised you weren't going to embarrass me. Okay, 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 said his mom. I'll be very careful. I will not embarrass you anymore. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Look, said Andrew. There's Taylor J from my school. How about I stay with Taylor J and you go shop by yourself for a while? Good idea, said Andrew's mom. <coughs> Taylor J said, Andrew, I'm going nuts. My mom is embarrassing me all over the place. I'm glad you are here, so my mom will leave me alone. Maybe you should not be so glad, said Taylor J. Here comes my mom. Uh-oh. Taylor J's mom came up and said, Taylor J, do you want me to buy the pink underpants or the yellow underpants? You Oh, yelled Taylor J's. Underpants in a boy's face, Andrew said, and Taylor J ran across the mall and jumped into a trash can. I'm so embarrassed. After a while, their bum 
Their mamas came by and knocked on the trash can. Andrew said to his mom, Why are you in the trash can? I'm here because I'm so embarrassed, said Andrew. Me too, said Taylor G. I don't believe in underpants and a boy's face. Hmm. Not now, said their moms. You're just too sensitive. You should not let things bother you so much. Okay, said Andrew and Taylor J. Then this won't bother you. They jumped out of the trash can, ran into the middle of the mall, and yelled, Our moms snore like grizzly bears and blame it on our dads. <laughs> Good one. High five, Asa. Both moms yelled, ah, and they jumped into the trash can. Andrew and Taylor J knocked on the trash can, and their moms yelled, how can you embarrass us so? Well, said Andrew and Taylor J, we had good teachers. <laughs> and that was the day at the mall. Okay, kids, it's bedtime. Hope you have a a wonderful dream and hope you enjoyed the story. So wind down, don't fight, and go to sleep, okay? I'll talk to you tomorrow night. Good night.